Rainbow family, welcome back to our channel. Um, Happy New Year. You made it. Yes, this is a little late. It's like a week late, but you know what? It must be done. <laughs> These are my absolute favorite videos to watch after Christmas, so we just had to do it. And last year, you guys loved watching this one, so that's my decision making. <laughs> Anyway, um, in this video, I will be showing you what I got for Christmas, and of course, this is not me bragging. Like I said, these are my favorite videos to watch. I'm so grateful for everything I got this year, and it's it's really the giving for me. Me and my siblings kind of went all out this year because we all have jobs, so we just had so much fun just giving to each other and others, so this is the result of that. And if you're new, hello, my name is Peyton. I'm so happy to meet you. So glad you're here. If you'd like to join the family, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and hit that bell so you never miss an upload. I'm just going to start out small. So I have kind of been wanting the scrunchy bands for my Apple Watch for quite a while because I just thought they were kind of cute. It kind of just is a different way for you to like switch out your band and it can be more comfortable and things like that. So I got this black one, which is super cute and it has a little tie on it. And then I also got a pink one. I've been wanting these for a while, okay? If you guys don't know, these are the Illuminated Scripture Journal Bible set. This is the New Testament. So I have to also buy the Old Testament for it to go with, but it's a complete collection of the New Testament. And so basically, we have Matthew through Revelation in here, and they're all just beautiful books, each individual. So this is the book of Matthew, beautiful cover, like, I could cry about it. It's just so darn cute. And then, let's see if I can hold this up. And then when you open it up, it's just, it's like a journal Bible in a sense, but it's individual books, and it's just beautiful. And then it has typography on it, and... This is one of my favorite gifts I got this year because I have been wanting these and since I love art and graphic design and things like this, these are just beautiful to me. And so I'm excited to eventually get the Old Testament and have a complete collection, but it'll be really fun to do my Bible studies on these. Alrighty, and then another book I got was Live by Sadie Robertson, which I've also really been wanting to read. And so I'm excited about this and I saw it in Hobby Lobby all the time the many times that I've gone to Hobby Lobby. It's been here, but I think this is her newest one and I also wanted to read her last one, but this is gonna be a great time. I don't read that often, but when I do read, it's kind of like books like this that actually help you out and are good for your brain, good for your relationship with Jesus and all that good stuff. We love that. Alrighty, so I got a new purse. I didn't used to be a purse gal until I got a purse and then I was ruined, so. I have, so that, let me just show you. So I got this nice, cute, small Michael Kors purse. I'm in love with it, absolutely in love with it. You can hold it, it has the straps, all that good stuff. All right, and then I got the perfect gift. If your feet get cold, you need these. Um, these were called Heaties, or no, not Heaties. These were called uh, Warm Buddies or something like that, but these are those microwavable beads with lavender. So they smell super good and you put them in the microwave and then they warm up your feet. So they're like heat up socks and that's incredible. And so for me personally, I work at a desk like all day and so my feet get super cold and so <laughs> lifesavers love this and they're so soft. Um, I'm sure they come in a ton of different colors but I got the brown ones and I just think they're super cute and fun and they smell so good. All right, and then I can't really show you guys, but if you notice the quality of this lighting, I got a new ring lamp, which I am so grateful for. I was using like a super tiny one that always tipped over, like dropped my camera, barely stood up. So we have a much bigger one. Love it. Video quality in 2021 is going up. So I hope you guys continue to stick with me. And then also, Usually, I have to hang this bad boy up right here with tacks, but I was also gifted a backdrop stand, which I am t super thankful for because now I can move this bad boy around, we can film anywhere, and I don't have to tack up my paper. And my paper doesn't have to fall while I'm filming. Alrighty, and then, I haven't always been like big on always doing my hair and things, but I don't know, maybe some of you ladies, or maybe guys, I don't know, can relate to this, but my hair 
the curl only lasts if it is curled with a wand. And so, for Christmas, I asked for um, a wand that has like different attachments and things like that so I can do different lengths. So this brand is the Lang, Lang. I don't, I, I'm probably saying it terribly wrong, but I got the rose gold curling wand um, that comes with attachments, so I'm super pumped for that. Um, it comes with a whole bunch of different attachments so that you can do different lengths or different um, widths of curl. So this is one of the attachments. Love that. And so it came with five, actually. And so that has been a lot of fun. I've already tested out a couple of them, and the curl definitely lasts. And I would honestly definitely recommend this if you need, like, curling wands. Um, when I was looking into these, they are a little bit on the expensive side, but I think they're definitely worth the investment because this is one curling iron in one. And I'm obsessed with the, the packaging. It's so easy to take in your suitcase and everything like that, so... Highly recommend. Alrighty, then I got a Hydro Flask cup. Really slow to the trend, but I've always loved these little like lids. And so I wanted a Hydro Flask for Christmas um, just to have one of these cool straw lids. Um, I've already used this a ton, love this. For some reason I drink more water when there's a straw, so weird. But I got the yellow one, which is super cute. And this also, so it came with the lid for coffee for hot stuff and then you can also have this lid for water. I don't know if hot stuff can go through this but I'm sure, I don't know, I didn't read the directions but. <laughs> so I also got this really cute Carhartt quarter zip with a big pocket in the front and also I'm not like a working outside like manual labor type worker or person so I don't exactly and don't take any offense to that but I don't know exactly what this pocket inside is for because it's too small for my phone but it fits lip gloss but it fits lip gloss and chapstick perfectly so I put my chapstick in here and it was amazing and I didn't lose it but it's just this quarter zip it's this mint color it's super soft inside and super warm I am a person that is cold all the time, so I love receiving and just buying brands like this that have the super thick um, material and just keep you toasty, so I love this. I've already worn it. It's so soft. Um, yeah. And then lastly, I got this Columbia jacket, which I'm in love with. Um, it has that liner to keep you extra warm. And this can come out, so I can have two coats pretty much, and then it has the fuzz. I'm in love with this coat. I needed a winter coat so bad, and I'm so grateful to be able to receive a winter coat. Um, but yeah, for me, receiving my gifts were fun because I think for a lot of my friends and family, their love language is giving gifts, and I also absolutely love giving gifts. I'm not as good at receiving gifts, but for me... Probably the best part of Christmas was obviously Jesus' birthday, but <laughs> giving gifts. I started in October, you guys, and I bought everybody's gifts in October and had to wait till December for them to see them. But I was so excited to just see everyone open their gifts and it was just such a fun time. But that is my Christmas haul. I hope you guys enjoyed. These are my favorite videos and I've already watched all of them on YouTube, so... Yeah, but if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up so that I know you liked it. And I will see all of your beautiful faces on Sunday. Bye! Why am I so afraid just to say a hello?